I thought this most recent episode of The Bad Batch was not only really good, but really, really smart. And it makes me very excited for what we're going to see throughout season two. All right, the episode started and ended with Commander Cody being extremely cool and hoping that Crosshair would be and ultimately being disappointed. In between, however, we got what was a very dark turn on a traditional Clone Wars episode. I mean, this was almost formulaic. A squad of clone troopers is put in a dangerous situation with overwhelming odds and are forced to face off against battle droids. The heroic of our two main clones, Crosshair and Commander Cody, ends up turning the day. However, the ending is what really shows that the Clone War now is truly over. As the clones are breaking their way to the top of the Citadel, we see civilians scattering. We hear Commander Cody telling them that they're just there to help, but as viewers, we know that's not the case. Desix's rightful ruler says, we never wanted a part of any of this. The Clone Wars, the Empire, we just want to self-govern, but we've realized that peace was never an option. In another moment that mirrored the Clone Wars, we see Commander Cody talk her out of violence. However, unlike the Clone Wars, it ends with her being brutally shot by Crosshair. The episode ends with an idea we've heard from Jedi and Clone alike. We're not just battle droids, we are trying to make the galaxy a better place, and Cody has realized that he can no longer do so within the Empire, so he's now defected. Very interesting to see where his story goes through the rest of the season and whether Crosshair gets that redemption, I think yes. Let me know your thoughts and more though down below.